Hi, Dante and Troy. How are you? Hi. Good. How are you? Not bad. So congratulations on your very authentic, very lived-in performances. Really Thank exceptional you. work from both of you. So what did you like best about being a part of this production? Who do you want to go first? Both. I'll, go. I'll go. Okay, sure. Um, I think what's really special about our show um, is, you know, there's a lot of holiday content out there, but there's not a lot of content that specifically focuses on that coming of age time, you know, where you're 16, 17, 18, 19, where you're, you're at that point in life where you're becoming an adult, but still trying to hang on to childhood. And there's a lot going on there. And I think that a lot of specifically a lot of holiday movies, um, tend to focus on kids or like adults if we're talking about like the Hallmark channel or something like that. So I think that that that's really fun to be a part of. And I think that, you know, as far as representation goes, our show does a great job at showing people of all different walks of life, different cultures and uh, different identities. And um, I think that, you know, it's impossible to represent absolutely every kind of individual in one thing. But I think that our show is a great step in, you know, progression when it comes to to representation. So that's exciting. Yeah, I mean, uh, I, feel, I feel also it's a it's a great like, it's it's a great hope of what what we sh what we want in the world, like what we want to happen. Like it's super nostalgic. I feel like everyone would really like dive deep into it because it's, it's something that you want to see what you know isn't going to happen right now, you know, that type of thing. So, yeah, I, just, I feel like people are going to love it. I love it. <laughs> so, Troy, I loved your rooftop scene. It was so romantic and sweet. Oh. And Dante, I feel like as a Chicago native, I would really trust your pizza choices. So I love that setting for Boomer. <laughs> um, so do you have a favorite memory from filming? I mean, that for me, I, I always, uh, I've always made the pizzas. So I think whatever pizza we were using, it was a pizza that I made. I mean, I would make like pizza for the staff. Like sometimes I would just come in early. Like I would come in before we shoot just to make pizza. Like, so it was, it was, uh, that was my memory. It was fun hanging out in two booths all day, like, like two, three days at a time. Cause I'll just come in and eat like nine, 10 slices of pizza and just be chill and be good. <laughs> uh, Langston mostly spends time in his room. Um, so, but it was really fun because at the very beginning, Joe Trace, the show creator came up to me and asked me if I had any ideas on, on Langston's room. And I sent him a whole list of just little tiny things. I was like, I bet he was on like the cross country team. So he should have some like cross country trophies, but they should be like second place trophies. Cause he's not that good, you know? And so the very, very first day of set was of shooting for me was fun. Cause I got to go in and see Langston's room and see it all. And it was so perfect. And then um, most of the, most of the show, they just put me in very comfortable turtlenecks and robes. So I just had a lovely time. <laughs> and so in the show, Dash and Lily, they share their favorite places, their favorite movies, different things in the book of Deer. So what would you share in the similar book of your favorite unique like foods or movies or places that are unique to you? I mean, I, I, I live in New York, so I would probably do something food related, um, but I'm trying to think of like, cause everything, I don't know, LePain, LePain, LePain <laughs> cookies, which like is in the show and it's actually, they're, they're delicious cookies and I wouldn't even call them cookies. They're just like a mound of dough that they're calling a cookie. So I'd say go there. <laughs> Big dough cookie. I think what I would put in there, um, I don't know. Like me, I'm 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 really high on like music and like uh, so I would probably put something in there like CDs or something that they would have to go back and grab. You have to go back and find, you know, something like that. That's a better answer. I take back my answer. Just use Dante's answer. <laughs> Well, thank you so much, Troy and Dante, for your art, for your work, for your producing work. You're both so talented. I can't wait to see what you both do next. Thank you. Thanks so much. Have a great day. You too. Bye.